Welcome to Streaming Every Day. In this video, we will see how we can create a master manifest using Nginx Word module. In my previous video, I showed how you can install Nginx and configure it for the Nginx Word module. So we can check if Nginx is running by using system CTL status Nginx command. It's running in mine, that's why it's showing active. If you haven't watched the previous video, you can watch it and you will know how to install Nginx and configure the word module. Now what we have to do is we have to go to the directory where we installed the Nginx. And there we will create a folder called JSON. For the sake of this video we are naming it JSON but you can also change it. But you will then have to change it also in your Nginx config file which I will show you later. Yeah, so in my case the folder already exists and next thing that we have to do is we have to create a JSON file in the folder JSON that we just created. I will just use nano and you can use any editor you want. I will name it New York because the videos that I have downloaded in different resolutions and different renditions are New York based videos. So that's why I will just name New York and you can name it however you want and inside of this file we will have to add a JSON code which I will just paste it here and I will put it in the description you can find it there so what we are trying to do is essentially we are we, we are just telling Nginx that we have a video and we have different resolutions or different renditions of this video and please create a master manifest for us and then Nginx will automatically generate you a master manifest so let's uh, copy the code and paste it here I have it in my clipboard so yeah I will put it in the description and you can check it out there all right so we have a basic JSON code we have sequences and inside that we have the clips and the clips indicate the three resolutions that we downloaded and note that it is in the vault folder so we don't have a vault folder currently we will have to create this you can name it however you want but because in our nginx configuration that we created in, a, in the previous video we have mounted the vault folder so that is why we will have to create it with this name Otherwise, you can also change it, but then you will have to change it in the Nginx configuration file. So yeah, this is telling the Nginx to create a master manifest out of these three videos, which are the same video, but in different resolutions. And then let's create that VOD folder, VOD folder. And we will just move our files there. As you see, my videos are in the download directory. I will just move them to the vault directory. All right. So let's check if the files are there in the directory. And yeah, we have the three files. So now it is done. We will check if we made any error in the configuration by using nginx minus t command and everything is fine test is successful all we have to do now is get the url and go to our browser or a video player where you want to play your master manifest or download it so let's let's go to the browser first and yeah, we will just have to add that URL in the browser and that will download the master manifest and then you can do a curl on it or just look into it. So the URL will be something like HTTP localhost since we are running the Nginx on the localhost. And the name, uh, sorry, the video that is a tag that Nginx, the configuration provides. And then the name of the video uh, so we created it using the new york json file so that's what we will have to put in here and then we will add a slash and master.m3u8 
and that is something again provided by engine export module and you can see it is downloaded and inside of it we can actually see the three renditions the three resolutions that we wanted in our master manifest so yeah that's that's how you create a master manifest using nginx word module it's very simple there are way like there are a lot of things that you can do using this but i just wanted to show you how you can create a basic manifest and let's check it on this hls player if the video is working or not you can just google hls js and yeah that will give you one of the results will be this player and as you see it is working so based on the bandwidth or the based on the sorry based on the available bandwidth your video will be played on that rendition so since i probably have some bandwidth available i am getting the highest resolution that that was uh, 2160p and yeah that's how you that's how you create a master manifest you can add as many number of renditions in this and yeah let me know in the comments if you have any questions and i will get back to you as soon as possible thank you for watching this video and hope to see you in the next one